Hi everyone. Today we are going to see and the ferret concept. Okay. Um, so we are going to learn how to validate page title in the playwright. So we'll start from one one. Uh, we'll take one one scenario and we will validate it. Okay. So how to validate page title in the playwright? So that we are going to see. So now we will use this application. So this is also demo application para bank. So it contains so put up header the navigation code. So we'll start working with this application. Okay. So I'm creating one more test file. So page title. Okay, page it dot spit dot JS. Okay. So input so I am putting the test. Um, play rate slash test. So this one we need to remember. Okay. See our play rate our test. Yes. The rate. I'm the rate. Mm. Slash test. Okay. Our test case huh? test. How to validate page title. In playwright. So this is our first test case, a sync. This provided the page here. Here, await page dot. So we need to launch the browser, right? Page dot go to. So give this browser name. This is why. So we need to launch the browser, right? So we'll use go to method in the project. After that, so await expect. Expect the assertion we are using to validate the page title. So this is the page is the base dot to have title we can pick to have title. So this is, there are a lot of suggestions we are getting. Okay. So here automatically the expect is picked here. So from this play right now, we are picking the except module. Okay. What is the page title here? So para bank error PB caps. Okay, just remember, just type the same way. Para bank error. Okay. Now this is our test. We are ready with our test. So we need to run our test. Okay. And come time now. See, normally we know the command right mtx playwright test. So these are all uh, will execute now. All the test case and our tests will execute, but we we are now only with this test case, right? Copy this, copy relative part is fine. And uh, we need to run a specific browser, right? If an iPhone project Chromium, just will put the Chromium. So I found even here. So I'm running the test. I think it no test form. Yeah. Just to go here. So just view with provider.
Siri is running now. On test is running now. So we will see. So the browser launched. And on test you got passed. Okay. So go to here. Copy this URI, copy path. I go to the browser. Okay, so this is our project is Chromium and page title. This is our test case file and how to validate page title. This is our test case name. Go here and see it is running the browser Chrome first. So before hook page, it launched the browser. And here, see step by step it is given, but here also it is given. Okay, see expect page to have title. This one is correct. This test is correct. Suppose if, if you have added some space or something like this, some other test skills will fail. Let's see the failure. Hmm? Still, it is passing. I think space, you should fail it. That is something I type to. Okay. I think space it is taking. It should not take normally. Now let it run. So I have provided the value wrong. Hmm? Title value is errors. It should give an error. So we are doing positive testing and negative testing. Okay. Okay, let's see. It has given a directly to open for path, it is not open. So, this is the receiving string, this is the correct string, this is the I provided the wrong string, so it has failed. Okay, right? Suppose here just come, come into the correct one. Suppose I want to match with only paraban. How are you going to match? Let's see if I provide like this, we will check whether it works or not. Okay. So I am not doing the complete text. Only the some text I am giving. Some of the text, how of the title name I have provided. Okay. See, it is giving wrong right. This is the complete word. I provided expecting is half of the word partial. Partial title name I have given. So it is have given wrong right. So if you want to validate with the partial title name, so go go like this. So okay, slash slash. Okay, still it is giving error. Okay, so here I will remove the single core. Okay. Now I will try. Yeah, it passed. Can you see? So now we have validated the title with a parser string. Okay? Parser title name. So this is also one way. You can do any other way. Okay, if you want to do with a complete title name, 
So this is the script. This is the partial title name. If you want to go with the complete title name, you need to provide with a single quotes here. Space. Okay, like this. Okay, this is the title name, right? So both ways are correct. Okay. This is a partial title name. I'm valid with the passive title name. It got executed past. This is also full name, full title name. Okay. Thank you. I hope you understood this. Thank you.